Commander Hawthorne, you know how I feel about rookies. The same way I feel about autopilots. How may I assist you? Is there anything I can do, sir? They don't help, they just overcomplicate things. I'm better off just doing the job myself. Which is why I brought the rookie. Uh, hello? No. Buzz, protocol requires we bring him along. He's gonna have sad eyes. Buzz. You know I can't deal with sad Look eyes. Look at the rookie, Buzz. Nope. Look at the ro- Look. No, no. Lightyear. Nope. Look at him. Not looking. Look. Nope. Look. Look. No, Look. no, Look. no, Look no, no. Look at no. the rookie. <sighs> All right, all right! You win. <sighs> Look, feather... featherings... feather... It's a feathering instance, sir. Look, rookie. First, you will not speak unless spoken to. Yes, sir. Still talking. Second, respect the suit. This suit means something. It's not just protecting your body, it's protecting the universe. This suit is a promise to the world that you, and you alone, will do one thing above all. Finish the mission, no matter the cost. You will never quit. Whatever the galaxy may throw your way, will you please turn that off? <laughs> It's just too easy. You're mocking me, aren't you? Yeah, but in a supportive way. Engage stealth mode. It should buy us enough time. We're not gonna make it. Almost there. Okay, plan B. Ready? Go! <laughs> have apprehended cadet farther feathering veterans and feather oh, they got the rookie who i strongly suggested should not have joined in the first <laughs> hello buzz ah. i am socks your personal companion robot my what i was issued by star command to ease your emotional transition after your time away oh well that's very considerate of you robot feline but no, thank you. I'm afraid it's protocol. Sensors indicate you've missed four birthdays. Would you like a frosted snack cake to celebrate? Negative. That would compromise my nutritional regimen. We can talk about your feelings. I am an excellent listener. No, no, look. I've had a very long day. It did not go as planned. The mission was unsuccessful? Affirmative. Oh, no. I am so sorry to hear that. Thank you, Socks. You're welcome, Buzz. Shall we play a game? No, thank you. Are you sure? I can create a game specifically for you, based on your exact personality profile. Hey, listen, Socks, buddy, I'm pretty tired, so I'm gonna go ahead and hit the rack. Of course. <sighs> I can provide sleep sounds if you like. I have several options. Summer night, ocean paradise, whale calls. No, no, white noise is fine. Very well. Good night, Socks. Good night, Buzz. Allow me. Huh. Wait, what's happening? He, he, he overrode my override. How? People, 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 people. Lightyear, Lightyear! I know you can hear me. Return the ship to base right now, or so help me. Socks, let's break this hyperspeed barrier and get everyone home. Too. Who? The robots. Why are there robots? Where did the robots come from? Where did you come from? I came from here. Here? Wait. Buzz? Alicia? Oh. oh no, that's my grandmother. I'm Izzy. Izzy? But, but you were just a little 
Socks, how long were we gone? Meow, 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 meow. 22 years, 19 weeks, and four days. Whoa. Wait. Come on. In here. Uh, Thought I heard one. A robot? Yeah. <laughs> Impressive. Well, I am a Hawthorne. You sure are. You know, your grandma and I could practically finish each other's sentences. If you're anything like her, you and I are gonna make a Some great robots team. cry. Okay. Let's review our objectives. Kill the robots and don't die. Don't die, it's just something you wanna do every day. It's still an objective. If I may, we have one objective. We need to put this crystal in the turnip and get out of here. So, to do that, we have to get onto the base. To do that, we have to kill all the robots. To do that, we have to destroy the Zerg ship. And to do any of that, we have to not die. Uh, um, Derek? Allow me to explain Operation Surprise Party. It is a variation on Operation Thunder Sphere. Didn't you get a medal for that one? Two, actually, but, uh... Wait, how do you know about Operation Thunder Sphere? <laughs> I read all my grandma's Space Ranger books from cover to cover. Twice. Huh. Excuse me, Robot Kitty Cat. Oh, sorry. Sensors have indicated that the Zerg ship powers the robots on the ground. So we fly up there, we blow up the ship, and surprise, robots! You're toast. Then, we put your crystal in the turret and finish the mission. It's a good plan. To infinity. Are you trying to get me to pull your finger? Don't fall for it. No, not like that. It was... Uh, sorry, it's a thing your grandma and I used to do. Yeah. I, we would never... She didn't mean to... Anyway, forget it. In order to flee this planet, I'll have to destroy a massive alien ship. Alone. With no assistance of any kind. You know, we could help you. It is our plan. I can't allow that. Star Command Code 2709.3 forbids me from placing unqualified personnel in harm's way. Okay, but I'm a Hawthorne. It's more than just a name, Izzy. You have to know exactly well, how to react to every next? situation. Oh, thought I had that one. Okay. And you, you're in a correctional situation of some kind? Parole program. I do this, and they shave a little time off my sentence. But I really learned a lot in there. Darby can take any three things and make them explode. Okay. And what about you? Me? Oh, well, I thought this was going to be like a fun boot camp workout thing, but it is not. So I was actually coming out here to turn in my stuff and... He's uh, a quitter. I'm not a quitter. You were quitting? What are you talking about? I was just going in a different direction. Yeah, the direction of a quitter. You know what? I give up. <laughs> See? Hello, bud. Ah! I am Socks, your personal companion robot. I love Socks. Meow, 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 meow. That's a fan of Socks. When I heard Socks was doing this movie, I thought, I'm in. This is exciting. A new adventure. Socks is quite hilarious. There's no way in. Perhaps I could help. <gasps> He's perfect. <laughs> Thank you. Socks is like a Swiss Army knife. Allow me. A psychologist. We can talk about your feelings. I am an excellent listener. No, wrapped into a robotic cat. Beep boop, beep boop, beep boop, beep boop, beep boop. Beep boop. Socks is so much of the heart. He's purring. He likes it. I do. But at the same time, so much of the comic relief. <laughs> Boom. Whether it's finding emotional stability or companionship or just playing games. Socks, <coughs> you're inhibiting my visual. Oh, sorry. Is this better? Negative. It's a really sweet relationship. You're not authorized to be in this area. <laughs> I bought you five minutes. Hold on! This isn't gonna be pretty! That was utterly terrifying, and I regret having joined you. Disney and Pixar's Lightyear. Rated PG. Parents, now streaming only on Disney+. Plus. Buzz Lightyear mission log, Stardate 3901. After a full year of being marooned, our first hyperspeed test flight is a go. Who are you talking to? Uh, no one. You were narrating again. I was not. Just doing the mission log. You do know no one ever listens to those. I know that. Narrating helps me focus. Ready, Captain Lightyear? Ready as I'll ever be, Commander Hawthorne. This is exciting. A new adventure. I'm going to grant you four minutes to be off planet, but then you come right back to us. To infinity. And beyond. You are clear for hyperlaunch. Beep boop, beep boop, beep boop. Buzz? That was utterly terrifying, and I regret having joined you. Buzz Lightyear to Star Command. Come in, Star Command. Why don't they answer? Hey, hey! Shh! The robots. The what? What is happening right now? Alicia? Oh, no. That's my grandmother. But, Socks, how long were we gone? Meow, 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 meow. 62 years, 7 months, and 5 days. What? 
I hope you're ready for action. Because all we needed was a pilot. For what? To destroy the alien ship. I have a plan and I have a team. Darby can take any three things and make them explode. I do this and they shave a little time off my sentence. Okay. And what about you? Well, I thought this was going to be like a fun boot camp workout thing. <laughs> but it is not. <laughs> Did I get it? Pretty close. <laughs> I need the... You know what's saying? The harpoons? Buzz! Buzz, right here! The probability of survival with an inexperienced crew is 38.2%. Hmm, seems a bit low. Mission failure imminent in three. Grandma always said she believed in you, too. One. That was a big squirrely too. Oh, I think I need a bag. No, no. Please record your last words. Do not vomit inside the vehicle. Do not vomit inside the vehicle. If you are satisfied with this recording, speak or select uh. one. To infinity. Are you trying to get me to pull your finger? Don't fall for it. No, not like that. Ugh. Sorry, it's a thing your grandma and I used to do.